want to stay well out of the way of all this metal and muscle. These big boys are roaring into town. I don't think I've seen so many Harleys at one time in my life. Just get an eyeful of what's behind me. It's rows and rows and rows of Harley Davidsons. But where's this convoy of 150 Harley riders rocking off to? This is no biker gang battle. These are Harley fans rooming their way to this. Wonder what's in this box? Well, wonder no more. It's the launch of the new Harley Davidson models in 2010. With a rock guitar to lead the way, Harley unveiled four new motorcycle models and the all-new Dyna Wide Glide took center stage. Is there anything in these four models that has never been yet seen in Harley? I would say it's a Dyna Wide Glide. We had Dyna Wide Glides before, but this Dyna Wide Glide is totally different. You know, it has a real comfortable look and a very cool look and it's also based on the old school chopper look. With a limited custom flame paint job and a 212 Tommy gun exhaust, fans of the Dyna series might find the wide glide hard to resist. The more the merrier it seems for these Harley lovers. Get away! Get away! The 2010 models launched included the new king of Harley's touring line, the Electra Glide Ultra Limited which boasted a performance upgrade of a Twin Cam 103 engine. Despite facing a sales dip of 15% this year compared to last year, Harley has forged ahead with the release of these four bikes. According to Harley, the economic downturn accounts for the slight drop in sales. To own a Harley, you would have to fork out between $18,000 to more than $50,000, and that's before you pile on the accessories. So what keeps people coming back for more? What's really the allure of Harleys? This is a question that's very difficult to explain because it's all about passion. You know, once you need the lifestyle, the passion, the people you mix with, the brotherhood, the comradery, you know, it's just that we, everyone knows each other here and they just like to get together and be part of the family. For this biker chick, the booming roar of the Harley is not a turn-off, but a one-up against other male bikers. I make heads turn and I feel that I'm more superior than a guy. <laughs> Why? Okay, how, how, does that, how does that come about? Well, riding bikes is mostly a guy's thing. Not many guys also doing bike riding. So I'm a girl and I'm riding a bike and it's, it's a Harley. And you like, feel like one up them, right? Yeah. And for some others, it's about expressing a secret alter ego on weekends. I have different image. Monday to, to Friday, you know, just like a working people. Then on Thursday night, when I go to the malls, I change to a white robe and white hat. It looks different. And weekend, I look like any riders so even my neighbors cannot recognize me what kind of secret exciting lives do harley riders lead find out more on rage next week